Hey guys, uh, sorry for the bad hair. I usually put it to the side now. Um, <laughs> it's pretty bad. Uh, so tonight, or sorry, it's the night before my surgery. As you guys all know, I'm going for eye surgery. Yay! Um, so, <sighs> I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I know that they're gonna have to put an IV in. I mean, you know, there's no excitement for an IV. Because <laughs> I don't like needles. I mean, I will pass out while having a blood test done. So, um, hopefully, William will be coming. Uh, I'll have to figure this out. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get someone. To tape me before um, I go into surgery and then after so you guys will have entertainment <laughs> and also so I can see what I did because usually oh, people don't remember um, so while I'm at it I guess I'll show you guys some of the stuff that I did I don't have much. Um, oh, also, now that I've had supper, I can't eat anything else until after my surgery, and I can't smoke until after my surgery. So, <laughs> there we go. Um, that should be fun. Uh, so I'll definitely. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Anyway, I'll definitely let you guys know what's going on and stuff and. I'll do updates for the first four or five days after my surgery. Um, so, yeah. Um, let's get that stuff to show you. Ugh. I think I made a couple new charms as well. Some aren't baked. Ooh, I'll show you the unbaked one. Anyway, as you guys can tell, or whatever, shush, I'm tired. Uh, I've been using molds uh, to make molds, so, um, mold stuff to make molds. Um, so yeah, I'll show you guys my molds here. I do have another one, actually, that reminds me, it's still in the freezer with a cupcake baked in it from last night. <laughs> Anyway, so this one, my friend brought back this coin from Australia, um, and it's their tuning. Um, so I just made a mold of it. You can't really tell. Plus, it rubbed away because the coin fell out halfway through, so I'm just going to use it as like a dinner plate mold or whatever. And also, these are silicone, so they are pretty bendy and stuff, so, and reusable. Next, I have this, um, Lucky Charm thing that I had. Let me see if it's in here. Probably not. Anyway, so it looks like this. So I made a mold out of that. And this one is this. Then I had a bookmark that had a really pretty heart on it. And I really liked it. So I was like, mm, why not? So that's what it looks like. It's just got little swirly designs on the inside. And again, it's bendy. Uh, and then I just had these little clay hearts that I had already made different sizes so I just fit them all onto one so I can make more hearts and I started using that and actually it's pretty cool I like using molds so um I'll go get the cupcake base 
to show you because then I can show you what it looks like when it comes out. So, oh, one second. Okay, so this is absolutely frozen solid. <laughs> um, so, this is what the cupcake face looks like. It's just a multicolored one. Uh, this is what they look like when they come out from the back of the mold. And this is the mold part. Um, and I got a like. I know that, like, it's really not easy trying to find a mold that, uh, for cupcakes. So, yeah, you put the clay in. I still use mine because my clay was really, uh, warm. But, and then you just pop it out. And boom! There is your cupcake face or whatever you want to use it for. So now, um, like I was saying, I know a lot of people have been looking for things to use for cupcake faces because I am one of those people <laughs> and I couldn't find anything for the longest time and then somebody, I read a comment and somebody said to use the little Reese Cup Minis. And so I bought some the other day and I was like, well, I'm going to still use this one so I can make this. Um, and so it turned out very well. Um, and yeah, so I'm quite excited about that. Um, and they're easy to make. They're done in like five minutes. Um, so they're really quite cool. Um, so I made a couple fail cupcakes, so I guess I'll show you them, and I did use the heart mold as well. Um, now, I have to be careful, just because remember, I didn't bake these yet, so <laughs> they look so terrible. <laughs> so this is a pink cupcake face with just a normal top, and then horrible chocolate on the top. <laughs> And that was actually my first attempt, or sorry, my second attempt. This was my first one. Um, so I used a tip for that. And it's just plain, which I realize I don't like. Um, so anyway, those are my cupcakes. I do have an orange cupcake here as well. Or, yeah, cupcake. Yeah, cupcake. Um... I don't really like as much, but I will do something so that it is cute. Um, and then here are the little hearts. So, uh, I had to cut the extra off of the top with these so that they're flat back. Um, just the way that the mold was. So, anyway, so that's the big heart. Um, the tiny heart I did in green, and then the medium sized heart I did in pink. I actually did two of each color, but I'll just show you the colors that I like. So, um, that's about it. Also, um, yeah, that's about it. So these, these charms that I used, that I made before, just like these the ones that I used for that mold. I will make another video of me using all of these molds to show you guys. So, and then my cupcake face one, so I'm just going to put that back in. Um, but anyway, yeah, so that is what I've been up to. Not a whole lot. Um, and then, again, with all the post-surgery stuff, um, I will get those videos 
here somehow. I will get them done. Um, and I will upload them. Also, Don, thank you for your comment. Uh, my little fail face. Yes, I know. I'm quite funny. Um, as far as, um, oh, what are they called? Where you imitate a person, like, um, crud, what are you? Um, homages look. <laughs> um, impersonate, yeah, my impersonations, I, uh, Sorry. <laughs> anyway, uh, I don't understand quite what you mean by that. I don't, although I don't remember what my other video is about, so I will have to go check that out. Anyway, um, I do have some requests for you, uh, but I'll send those to your inbox. So have a great week, and see you guys later. Bye.